Welcome to Crazy Take and today in this video I'm gonna flash the Lineage OS 14.1 which is based on Android Nougat 7.1.1 Right now I'm using Resurrection Remix ROM which is also based on Android Nougat 7.1.1 And now let's try the Lineage OS and see how it is The download link of this ROM and the GF files uh, is in the below descriptions so go for that link and you can download this room I would recommend that just wait for the full review or wait for my uh, initial review whatever I going to I'm going to post another video I will tell what are the bugs uh, what are the pros and cons everything I will discuss you know, with you later this is the initial video so I do not recommend you to flash this one because there might be some major bugs uh, so I'm trying this as my own so you can also try this uh, if you want you are if you are really excited you can try this also and this version is the latest version of this lineage os for lenovo k3 node which is developed by danny hk and uh, it just released uh, on 14th february that means uh, uh, yesterday so that's cool i hope that there should uh, be very less bugs so let's try it and let's see what we can do with it so you can see we are uh, reporting to the recovery do not worry if you do not have uh, this kind of twrb recovery whatever twrb recovery you have you can use it and you can flash this room easily so guys let's flash this as always we have to uh, wipe the uh, Dalvi cache cache and user data for the safety for the clean flash so first of all just do it and uh, click that swipe to wipe button and it will wipe the um, Dalvi cache cache and the user data and after that you just go to the install section and here what you have to do you have to select if you have if your uh, ROM file is in internal storage then that's not an issue you can find it in the internal storage but if your uh, ROM files and the GF files are in the SD card then you should have to select the external SD card so let's now find out the ROM so here as you can see at the bottom as you can see two G files are here one is Linux 14.1 which is released on 2017-02114 that means 14 February 2017 and the GF file is 7.1 G apps files and it is based on 64-bit architecture so let me flash the ROM as you can see the flashing process has started and I'm going to skip this video to save your valuable time so guys as you can see I have successfully flashed the ROM so let me go back and now let's flash the GS file which is based on Android 7.1 no good and it's based on 64-bit architecture uh, which is from arm so i think you shouldn't have any kind of issue regarding downloading the gs files a lot of you guys have asked me regarding the gs file which is the perfect gs file so what do you have to do for this any kind of no good room if you want to uh, flash the apps just download the 7.1 version based on 64-bit architecture and it's made by arm as you can see gfs is flashing so i'm going to skip this video or fast forwarding this video so guys as you can see this flashing process is successful now and just do the y for safety and now click on reboot system so it will reboot uh, to the lineage os and let's see how the boot animation i'm really excited what kind of thing is going on right now so <laughs> this is the animation logo of lineage os so looking pretty cool another new thing um, you are going to see on your lenovo k3 node that's pretty cool so let me uh, skip this video to save your time because this may take five to ten minutes i don't know so finally as you can see it booted up and uh, there is a new logo of lineage os which is looking pretty cool i hope that you guys uh, may like it so let me do the first setup as always so some boring stops so first impressions guys uh, it's looking pretty cool and it's very fast and fluid uh, actually there are very few apps but also it um, looks like the cyanogen mod 14.1 which i have reviewed earlier you can check the video in the lenovo k3 note playlist that also a uh, lot close a lot similar to this one 
so you can see that this rom is based on android 7.1.1 and this is a lineage os so uh we are really excited regarding the lineage os let's see how it performs in day-to-day -day usage for that i have to check it more and i will be coming with another video and i will clear for all your doubts kindly do let me know what other questions uh, in the comment section below i will surely try to answer all of those questions if the questions rate increases i will make a video on it so guys uh, feel free to ask me any kind of questions uh, do you have so in this video you can see camera is working photo is working video is working audio recording is also working you don't have any kind of major issues like this so i hope uh, you will stay with me in the next video to know more about this room so yeah guys thank you guys thank you guys for watching and have a great day